Hello everybody, it's Linda and I've got a new mini album to share with you. Uh, I made this album these past two days and uh, I'm really happy with how it turned out. I used the Prim Prima Printery collection and um, I just used uh, some leftover tip boards and stuff to make the pages in the album. And uh, I also used some images that I printed off the internet, um, mainly from uh, Magic Moonlight Images, uh, who offers free downloads uh, online. So um, I'll put the link below to the the, uh, the the website. So yeah, let me show you what I did. <clears throat> Sorry, uh, I just um, used um, chipboard for this front cover and I painted and distressed the edges with white and gold and distress inks and stuff and I used uh, Tim Holtz I think it's a book plate that's what it's called I don't I'm not sure um, I just uh, stamped the word explore and I put it inside the book plate here and I put some glossy accents on it these are I am roses and this is an I am Rose's gardenia, and I also put a gardenia in, in her hair. These are Prima pearls. This is a wooden heart that I just stamped and inked and distressed. And I made a stick pin. And uh, this is just an image that I printed off the internet. And I just painted and distressed it. And um, some lace here. And uh, some more Prima pearls. So that's the front cover. And here is the first page. Um, I also stamped some uh, words on tissue paper because if you glue down or mod podge uh, the tissue paper, you can hardly see that it's paper. And um, I like that effect. It becomes quite transparent. <clears throat> Sorry. Uh, here is some beaded trim, some more pearls. This is from the paper collection and uh, an I am Rose's flower and just a mulberry flower. I did um, Mod Podge all the images and uh, just went around them and distressed them to match the papers and the style of the album. And I made uh, quite a lot of tags. I used craft card stuff for my tags. Whoops, sorry about that strange light thing going on there uh, so yeah uh, that's uh, just a stamp and uh, that's that page here's the next page again I used the, this lace trim and uh, I'll put the link to the seller below uh, I use this lace on almost every page I love that sheer lace it's really pretty and here is some cotton trim and uh, I am Rose's flower, a wooden butterfly button, some Prima pearls. Again, one of the images that I was talking about and I did a lot of layering and distressing and I made a tag. And this page here uh, is made from just uh, an envelope that I folded. So I cr it created a pocket here and also a pocket up here with room for tags and then next page just tore some paper layered uh, I am Rose's gardenia here Prima pearls just some stamping and distressing and a couple of tags um, this says it's time and uh, this is from the paper and again the lace that I was talking about and uh, there's a quite a large tag behind here and I used uh, just a paper from the paper line and uh, yeah and also uh, this page is made out of a, a bigger em envelope that I just cut to size and uh, made a tag here using the Martha Stewart ah, I don't like that light <laughs> sorry uh, use the Martha Stewart punch here and uh, another tag and this tag here opens 
I think. Yeah. <clears throat> it opens. So that's that page. And uh, the next page here. Um, this is uh, Tim Holtz clock uh, die cut uh, that I bought online and just some layering of the paper again a stamped word here there's a tag behind her or a photomat and uh, the next page is a gardenia from my amorosis um, just a leaf also from my amorosis and uh, a button with some twine some layering this is a, a ribbon and that's also a ribbon and tags in this pocket a photo map and uh, this page here is actually made out of canvas uh, that i just sew or sewed on the edges here and i left an opening here for a tag and um, this also forms a, a pocket uh, again an image here some lace stamped word and i am roses gardenia i used uh, a lot of gardenias from i am roses in this album and i distressed the heck out of them and uh, i did some layering here some burlap and uh, stamping and here's a tag here and there's a tag up here and uh, there's also a tag in this pocket here and behind her <clears throat> sorry and uh, <laughs> another gardenia and again layering and um, uh, i attached these charms to the back of this flower here gardenia and uh, some more lace trim and tag behind here uh, I made uh, almost all of the the images and the layered papers for to form um, pockets <laughs> sorry uh, I'm really concentrating <laughs> and uh, here's a pocket and this page here is another uh, canvas pocket page and uh, this one here is just um, some leftover chipboard that I had and I just cut it to size so all the pages are different sizes but I, I like that it it sort of fits the style of the album I think okay so here some more layering and uh, some pearls <coughs> sorry from Prima and uh, I am Rose's gardenia <laughs> this is not as yellow as it looks but it's uh, it's pretty nice anyway oh and uh, I have to say that I just sprayed all the gardenias and flowers with glimmer mists from Lindy Stamp Gang I just love their glimmer, mist, glimmer mists and here there is no pocket so this is just for decoration the pocket is here on the side here and uh, here's a huge moth and some prima pearls lace layering stamped and uh, let's see what i'm trying to do here <laughs> yeah there's a pocket here with room for a large photo mat and this page is just chipboard and here is um, another page and this is just for decoration this has like no functional pockets here there is just a whoops sorry about that <laughs> there's just a small pocket here oh let me see with the tag says a love story so that goes in here and this is the the last page uh, with some layering and here there was i was going to have a pocket here but stupid me <laughs> i just uh, thought i was working with the back page or like the final um yeah i think it's called the back <laughs> back cover uh, of the album uh, so i turned the page um upside down and uh, everything so i i just had to just make it like for decoration so but i i like it anyway and uh here is the back cover of my album just some layering and lace and some beautiful images and a moth 
and um, that's that's ribbon and that's the lace again so that's my album i just made um, a charm on a swivel clasp here uh, with an angel some gorgeous glass beads and a key and a clock and yeah just a lot of stuff here and uh, also i'd like to show you a canvas uh, that i altered and um, it says memories remember with love and uh, i did a lot of stamping and layering and distressing with uh, distressings from tim holtz and, and these are actually uh, like uh, lace stickers that i just glued on and this is a stamp uh, it's one of the stamps that I got from Anna Axanero one here on YouTube and I really love the stamps thank you so much Anna and uh, I use it here and also here and on the sides so um, I just tried to to make something go over the edge since it's uh, a deep edge canvas and uh, yeah, I'm quite happy with how it turned out. Look at this little darling here. <laughs> and uh, yeah, so I'll uh, leave the, the links to where I got the images and laces and stuff below. And thank you so much for watching. I really hope you liked what I've done. And um, see you again soon. Bye bye.